Welcome to our first ever Pokemon trading card game video. I'm so excited to be filming this. I sound a little bit sick right now because I am sick. <laughs> if you guys don't know me, I'm Frosty Caribou. Most people just call me Boo. I'm a full-time streamer on Twitch. I have been for a couple of years now. I just recently got into a Pokemon trading card game or really just Pokemon in general. I played some of the games when I was younger but I never really got into it until Pokemon Let's Go came out. I actually had a chance to go to Tokyo around the same time Let's Go came out. I was so hyped about Pokemon, I got to visit some Pokemon centers in Tokyo and got some awesome cool things, some plushies. And you know, I just had a really good time and it made me kind of want to get into it more. Me and my boyfriend Taco, who's also a moderator in my Twitch channel. Our first box, really his first box, of Pokemon trading cards from a Target, February 12th of 2019. Really, we've only been doing this for, or starting our collection for about two months now. We're really into it. You can see we have so much stuff already. <laughs> two months. Yeah, we're, we're, we're loving it. <laughs> Got our coffee. We got our Elite Trainer Box. We're doing Guardians Rising. I wanted this one so bad. I really wanted this one because it has yellow dice in it. And this is like probably my favorite color. I call it Organic Egg Yolk because that's just what color it is. And it has beautiful, beautiful yellow dice and all the yellow sleeves and everything. I've been super excited to open this. Um, I should probably cut this part out because I am probably the worst person at opening packages. This is just saran wrap and I can't even open it. Yeah. I don't even know what Pokemon this is. Oh, the, the electric one? Ah, oh, yes. You know, a lot of these Pokemon I don't even recognize. <laughs> so we're gonna be kind of learning together. If you guys have any comments or advice or information that I'm lacking in this video, please feel free to leave them in the comments or visit my Twitch channel or hit me up on Discord or whatever. You know, I'm super noob and I will take all the help I can get. <laughs> Before we get started opening our Elite China box, I just wanted to explain a couple of things here on our screen. Um, first of all, we have our stream deck, our beautiful stream deck, which is decked out. Wow, that was a horrible pun. I'm so sorry for anyone that just had to hear that. Anyway, it's decked out <laughs> with um, some of our Pokeballs just for decoration, but these three buttons in the middle actually do have a function. Um, if we pull a GX card, a full art card, or a secret rare card, we actually have separate celebrations that will pop up on the screen when that happens. I'm so excited. I hope we get to open a couple today. R and Jesus, will you bless us with some good Pokemon cards, please? In the corner up here, our goal cards. Um, these will obviously be changing depending on what we're opening. In the Guardians Rising, I scrolled through, saw what I would like to have from that card that would be the most valuable to me from that box, and that is why we have the Tapu Lele GX rainbow card up there because I think it would be awesome if we pulled that today. I usually get pretty terrible pulls, so if I pull that card, I would be extremely shocked, honestly. <laughs> All right, let's get into this pack. Opening the box, we're opening the box. Okay, so first off, let's see what we got here. So we got sleeves. I actually really needed some more sleeves. The prime reason I wanted this box because these dice are adorable and I really like their color. TX and our little tappy things. One thing I really like that comes with these as well are the actual like booklets. This was super helpful, especially when I was first starting. Um, just to get to see like what cards are in the entire series for Guardians Rising and actually see, you know, how valuable and special the cards that you pull are. So those are really nice. We actually keep all of these as well. So we have a little collection of them too. And then, the meat and potatoes. We got booster packs. Yay, boosters. I think this is eight. Yeah, I think it comes with eight booster packs. So we're gonna be opening these bad boys today. Hopefully we get something great in them. If we pull that Tapu Lele, that'd be awesome. I feel like I'm gonna open a card and it's gonna be like a really cool, valuable 
nice card and I'm not even gonna know. <laughs> I'm just gonna be like, oh cool, this is so cute. Oh my god. And then people in the comments are gonna be like, bro, it's this card. Um, so I think we're supposed to do two so cards. I'll put those four underneath those two. Like that? Yep. All right, we got our little Alolan Vulpix. Uh, Fetchling. Oh, where should I put these? I guess I'll put them over here. Fetchling. I'm a chop. Oh, I actually don't. I don't think I have either of those, so that's kind of cool. I'm a chop. I definitely don't have that guy. Um, Phantom. Definitely don't have that guy as well. I actually haven't opened a lot of Guardians Rising packs, so these will probably, a lot of these will probably be new to me. Barboak. I don't know if that's how you say his name, but he looks like a cute little eel. I actually think I've caught this guy in Pokemon Go a couple times, so that's cool. We got a Water Energy. A multi-switch, I don't have that one too. Um, a watchdog. Glalie? I don't know what that one is, but he looks like, oh, you know what he looks like? He looks like one of those um, like cat toys, the ones that have holes in them and then they have like a jingly ball inside, you know what I mean? And the, the cat like tosses him around and he's got a jingly ball, okay, I'm done. Dude, I've actually been really wanting one of these Alolan Sand Slash. I think it was from a different series that I was looking at, but we have a reverse Hollow Alolan Sand Slash. He's so pretty. I love him. And then I guess our last card. <gasps> is this a whale? I don't know what this is, but <laughs> we got our first first pack. Super lucky, we got a GX card in our first pack. A wishy-washy. I actually don't even know what this Pokemon is, but he's very cool and it looks like he's got, what is that, like another fish living on top of him? I don't even really know, but it looks great. We got our first GX card, I'm super hyped. He's a cute little whale, dude. I don't even know if Taco knows what this one is. Taco, do you, have you ever seen this one? Yeah, you have him? Oh, Taco already has him. Wow, way to kill my buzz, right? It's okay. We're still hyping it. <laughs> I love it so much. I'm super hyped. Okay, let's put those two over here somewhere on the screen so we can actually start collecting. Um, we got our nice little celebration here going for our GX cards. I hope you guys liked that cute little animation. We're gonna start doing those every time we pull a GX card. So let's hope we get some more of those or maybe some other special special opening cards as well. That'd be super cool. Oh, I have this guy, that's for sure. All right, let's see if we can do the trick correctly this time. Um, okay, so let's do the four, then you take two, then you put the four under there. Okay, I think that's right. So let's hope that's correct. Okay, a Mudbray, he's like a little donkey bro. I'm very biased toward pink Pokemon. Um, just because, I don't know, I think they're like way cuter. Honestly, I think we're gonna start doing like a cuteness scale. We'll just pick out the cutest card of, of the day from our polls because <laughs> some of these dudes, like look at that guy. What a cutie, you know? You just, you, you, gotta, you gotta rate them on cuteness. Maybe they're garbage Pokemon, but at least they're cute. All right, we got a rock rough, a tail low. We got a fist bump energy. We got a Malo, reminds me of marshmallows. Okie dokie. Altar of Moon. A Weeping Bell. <gasps> oh, this one actually isn't that hype, but it's hype for me because I actually needed this one, so that's hype. A uh, Lowen Golem, and he's a reverse hollow. He's super cool looking. And then our final card. Ooh, I have this dude already. It's just a rare. Oh, I don't have a hollow form of him though. A rare hollow Minior. He's like a cute little star. Two packs down. I'm actually super happy with these pulls so far. Especially because like I never pull GXs. So honestly that GX was pretty hype for me. I never get GXs. It's, it's a very rare occurrence for me. Taco always gets tons of GXs. He gets such good pulls and I'm so jealous all the time. All right, we got a wishy-washy. Oh, here we go. So this must be the basic version. Wait, wait, what? Wait, so this is a wishy-washy and that's a wishy-washy. Is this just like wishy-washy on like roids? What is happening? Is like a giant, he's giant? 
This is small. He's big. I don't know if this is the same Pokemon. I guess he's just like super buff version. I don't know, honestly. All right, we got a wishy-washy. That's definitely a new one. Um, a Deli Bird. I love this card so much. He's so cute. A Mudbray. Another Slowpoke. Another Gloomy. Wow, this is going like the exact same order. We have Eyeball Energy. We got a Watchdog again. A Glalie. So we're getting a lot of duplicates here. Enhanced Hammer. Oh, I think I needed that one. <gasps> I love getting reverse hollow. Honestly, I just love getting like supporter trainer cards, especially new ones. I don't have this guy yet, so reverse hollow. Holla. Holla. Okay, I'm done. Uh, and then our final card is a Liligant. Rare. Grass Pokemon. I actually have not seen this one yet, so that's bomb. A Liligant. A beautiful Liligant. Okie dokie. I really, 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 really hope we get a secret rare today. I mean, that would be absolutely insane if that happened, but you know, one a girl can dream, you know? <gasps> I love this card so much. Uh, again, with the pink Pokemon, but I just think Chansey's adorable, so. Uh, Gothita, Gothita. A lone Vulpix, another Fletching, another Machop, um, a Leaf. Energy, slow bro, oh my god. Okay, if we're doing a cuteness scale, this guy's gotta take the cake. I don't think I could find a cuter one today of a cuter card than this slow bro. He's absolutely adorable. I'm gonna set him to the side. He's he's our cuteness winner for now, <laughs> unless we find a cuter one than that. Machoke, lifting that heavy, heavy rock he's got there. Uh, Lampent, ooh, it's like a lamp Pokemon. I'm guessing he's like a nightlight. That's actually kind of cute. It looks like he's wearing, wearing a cute little lampshade on his head. I like it. Um, Helioptile? I don't know if that's how you say this guy's name. Um, I actually think I needed this card. I'm pretty sure I don't have this one. Actually, I'm 100% sure I don't. Uh, reverse Hollow Helioptile. And our last card. Ooh! I don't know what this card is, but it looks like he's probably special. A Gudra. A, a hollow Gudra rare. I feel like that's a good one, honestly. I, I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like that's probably a good one. So I'm super hyped. And he's so cute. He's so pretty. I love him. All right, we have half our packs opened. Let's see what the rest of these guys bring us. Hopefully some good cards. I will struggle bus opening the rest of these as well. I'm actually so hyped I'm doing the little card trick correctly. I would never, I never knew how to do it before and now we're doing it right. Uh, I used to just take six and put them on the bottom and then actually flip the cards over, but you would actually switch up the, the rares that way, so it wasn't technically the correct way. I would get my my best card would be second to last instead of last, so now we're doing it the right way. All right, Cottony, a low and sand true, a stuffle, a tentacle, helioptile, a lightning bolt, energy, clefable. What the heck is this? Oh my gosh, this art is kind of scary to me. He's like a 3D, like, I don't know. He's just kind of freaky. He's like, hello. Where's the camera? Hello. <laughs> like, that's like my nightmares. Gliscor. I actually have not seen that guy before. He's pretty cool. He's like a bat. Um, Hakamo. What is this? Hakamowo. Hakamomo. <laughs> Hakamo. Oh. Welcome to the club, Hakamowo. Rock Ruff. Oh, okay, so we got a reverse hollow Rock Ruff. And, ooh, looks like it's just um, non hollow rare Ori Corio? Or is it possibly Ori Sorio? I don't know how that C is pronounced. I'm gonna say Ori Corio. Super cute. I love him so much. Those are our two for this pack. Very nice. Um, honestly, the the amount of hollows was the Lilycan hollow as well. Oh no, he was non-hollow. 
Okay, so, I mean, I don't usually get a lot of hollows, so <laughs> the fact that I even got one is like lucky for me. <laughs> I'm not even lying. I never pull good cards, I swear. Okay, for those two. I always watch like Pokemon card opening YouTubers too and I feel like they, they get the best pulls. I don't understand. It's like, dang bro, who's rigging your packs? Who's rigging your packs that you're cracking? They're so good. Okay, we got a Goomy, Goomy Booby Booby, uh, Rock Ruff, a Tailo, Nose Pass. Dude, I'm trying to be so chill about this, but I'm so hyped for all of these, all of these Pokemon because I don't have any of these. <laughs> like, I can't wait to log them. I have this app where I log all my Pokemon and it's like, I'm so psyched for this. Uh, I just don't want to be like super super noob in front of you guys like whoa What's this card? I've never seen this thing before and he's like so casual to you guys like whatever. It's just a So landed who cares, you know, I don't even know Le leap energy a beware. Oh, dude Is he punching something? I I think he's like punching a tree or something. That's kind of a cool art. I like that. <gasps> Whoa, I've actually never seen this card, but that is a that's a pretty one. Alo Momola. Alo Momola. I like that. Sounds like some sort of alcoholic beverage. Um, rescue stretcher. I needed more of these, so I'm happy with that. Altar of Sun Reverse Hollow. Yes, I love this. Okay, cool. I, I keep all of my um rares and holographic cards in a binder so that's where this guy will go and our last card wow that's actually a pretty garbo last card honestly because i already have a bunch of these but a vanillax <laughs> a vanillax is still a rare still you know, he's still a cute little ice cream cone guy, so let's give him the benefit of the doubt. I still love him. Honestly though, I was trying to collect these for the longest time because I just, I had both the base and the stage one and I could never get the stage two and it's just so ironic that I'm always pulling stage two now and I could never get them before, so. I guess this is karma, like, oh, you wanted Vanillax? Now you're getting him, buddy. <laughs> I love it. Okay, we got two packs left, so let's see what we got here, boys and girls. I see a tentacool. I see a tentacool. A uh, cold card. Okay, four, two, switcheroo. Alright, I'm feeling lucky about this one. Feeling lucky. Alright, we got a tentacool. A beldum. Helioptile. Phantom. A stuffle. A fairy, oh. Aquapatch, Marini, Sableye. Something about this guy, he's just so cool to me. I don't know if it's because he's got gems for eyes, but I like him a lot. Oops, I forgot to mute it. Unprofessional video maker right here. Reverse Hollow Wishy Washy. Um, man, I, I actually didn't even know this Pokemon existed, but now that I know, it's like, he's so cute. He's just adorable. All right, and then our final card. Looks just like a Alolan Sandslash, non-holographic, rare card. I'm actually okay with that because I don't have that guy, so. Any any amount of those are, are cool beans to me. Okay. Okay, you guys, last pack here. Let's hope it's something great. I was telling Taco that we should get a really, really accurate scale and just start measuring these cards. You know what, I'm gonna have to take a break because I need to blow my nose. So I'll be right back, guys. Let me go find the tissues. Blew my nose, let's take a sip of coffee. Oh man, that coffee's good. Taco, the coffee's really good. It tastes fantastic. Okay, now we're fully ready for some last pack, some last pack juju, baby. Hopefully it's good juju. Hopefully I can open it. But uh, as I was saying, I was telling Taco we need to get like a really accurate scale and just start weighing these bad boys at the store. 
It's so overkill. <laughs> just start throwing Pokemon packs down on the scale. That would just be like next level. That's like too much. Too much. Okay, last pack. Did I already do the trick? I think I did. All right, Carvana? Is that how I say that? Uh, that dude's pretty cool. It looks like sort of a fish that is on land. Oh, sorry guys, that wasn't in the camera at all. A fish that's on land. Taylo. Jang Mo. <laughs> what is with these names? Jang Mo. Oh, I like him. He's got hearts on his head. That's pretty cute. Deli Bird. A Travis. Ooh, I needed that guy. I got a Steel Magnolia. Gothorita, Field Blower, Hakamo. Oh. And, ooh, I actually think I needed this one uh, because I don't have him from this pack. He's a Reverse Hollow Vanillish, aka Ice Cream. Ice Cream for Ice Cream. Ice Cream Cone, bro. Ooh, I'm already seeing some of this special. Let's see. <gasps> Woo! We got a second GX! This is insane! Dude, I never pull GXs. This is absolutely bananas. It's a Vika Volt. One I have never heard of as well. Um, he's a lightning Pokemon. Another thing I have very little of are just rares, holographics, and lightning Pokemon in general. So we got a Vika Volt GX, 240 HP. What? Oh, it's like blows my mind how much HP these GXs have. I know I'm like so noob at this. What is his, his stage one? What is that? It looks like he's a loaf of bread. Evolves from Charger Bug. I definitely don't have one of those. It looks like some sort of loaf of bread. <laughs> it's a loaf of bread. <laughs> Electric loaf of bread, baby. That's what we're gonna call him. Whenever I pull that guy, he's the electric loaf of bread. It's just happening. Okay, so that's our DX pull. We got two GX pulls in this pack. I'm actually so happy about this. A water and an electric. Water's probably my favorite. Um, water's probably my favorite, what, genre? My favorite type? <laughs> Water's my favorite type of Pokemon. I have a water deck, um, but I'm super happy with both these pulls. All right, you guys, so these are our pulls from this pack. Obviously, we got our two GX cards here. That I'm super happy with. I hope this camera will focus. Um, we got a lot of reverse hollows in this pack as well, which I personally love reverse hollows because they're extra shiny, but I know most people um, generally like hollows a little bit more than reverse hollows, but I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Of course, our cute card of the day, the slow bro. I just don't think you can get any cuter than this guy. He's just too cute. He's like, oh no, my fruit fell in the water. What do I do? I guess I gotta go get it. He's like as big as the island he's on. It's just adorable. Everything about this card is so cute and I love him so much, so. 10 out of 10 on the cutie scale. Okay, so wrapping it up from me and Alpaca Shirt. Um, overall, the Guardians Rising box we just opened, I'm super happy with it. Not only is it a beautiful shade of organic egg yolk, but we also got two amazing GX pulls, two hollow rare cards as well. I'm super happy with that. Like I said, I never pulled GXs, so the fact I got two of them in this in eight packs is super hype. Very, very hype. You know, anything over that would have been insane. So I'm happy with that pull rate for this box. I'm happy with everything I got in this box. And I'm so excited to be increasing my Guardians Rising collection because it was pretty low. So now we got some cards to add to that to log into my little app today. Thank you guys so much for watching my first ever video. It's been very kind of daunting diving into the Pokemon community because I'm so new to it and you know, I don't know a lot about this community yet, but I'm so excited and I've been welcomed by so many people and I just love creating content. So I'm glad to be starting videos and you know, being able to share them with you guys and I hope Coming up, we get to learn together 
gather some cards up and just increase our collection and you know have some fun times so I'm super excited I can't wait until we get to you know use those other stream deck buttons for some celebrations on some awesome cards I'm so excited to be able to film my reactions for things and you know get to look back on how hyped I was opening cards it's just a whole different experience so thank you guys so much for being a part of that we have some stuff back here uh, you can kind of see them, they're out of focus, but if you guys can guess what we might be opening next in our next couple of videos that we're going to be doing. Um, I'm super hyped. Taco has been absolutely feeding this addiction 100% um, as well. We're both super addicted, so we're going to be doing a lot of openings because we have a lot of stuff on the way. Thank you guys so much. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day. Make sure you stay extra cute like this slow bro, and I will catch you guys later.